All right, I got here late after playing another match. Uh, I'm not going to have enough time to update the overlay, but from what I'm told, Vodka is up game one. And then this is Coda Vodka. Uh, Coda with uh, Palutena this time. I didn't see who he went game one, but unfortunate. I guess SD there. I didn't. Sorry, too busy going between stuff. Now I have my attention, though. But Coda playing a full stock deficit. We'll see Vodka looking for his openings with the Nair here. Trying to make sure he doesn't get caught up by some crazy Palutena Nair loops and lose half of his lead. But it's a very patient game for both players right now. Just trying to both catch each other for these jumping approaches, but playing conservatively enough that I don't see any big hits there going right above Pal dash attack. Wave land on the platform, going to get punished out by that auto reticle, and then tries to go in, but a weird trade. He's going to take that option and back off. Both players content to find these poke options. Definitely fine with Vodka at this full stock advantage, but there's the F tilt. Tries to get the pressure with the auto reticle, then has him off stage with the Nair now at the ledge. Looks for this back air to keep him out of the corner. Vodka trying to get his way back with a grab, but a good jump to bait the auto reticle high and be able to stay on the ground means that uh, Koda not going to have an opportunity to come in. Catches him running in with the jab, has him off stage. What's the edge guard option? Just pops to let him back to the ledge, tries to get the down tilt two frame. Or option catch, but there's the down throw. Good DI, no back air. Okay, good get up attack to avoid that down tilt. And the jab sends him off stage again. Tries to get the ledge cancel. Drag down there. That was sick. Uh, all right, that was great. Maybe something like that is definitely what he's going to need to get his way back into this game, but a close range auto reticle, unfortunately, going to get punished by Vodka now out of the corner. Finds the dash attack with that good vulnerability on the shield, or tangibility, one of the two. Uh, not relevant at this point. Good jump above the grab. Now clips him with the Nair. Not enough to start a combo, though. Just trying to go back to using this auto reticle. Vodka still with the lead, but definitely not as comfortable as he was before. Trying to get these options off stage. Now has the throw. Is he going to go for this edge guard? Yes, we'll try to use the backer to hit the high recovery, but uh, Koda just opting to go low. There's another dash attack. Has him on the platform. Catches him his shield with uh, up air. A couple hits of the Dancing Blade. Good parry, but no punish. Does get hit off stage. Shield Breaker could have been very bad there. All right, good narrow one, but probably wasn't expecting that one to actually hit. And then a great Dolphin Slash to punish the landing option. Tries to two-frame the recovery, but will eventually catch the jump with the Nair. Now Vodka, again with a pretty comfortable lead, but this Nair from Coda could potentially uh, start changing that. Definitely not the same as we saw in the earlier stock. Tries to catch the roll there, but not quite the right timing. Good up air on the platform into the back air. Now tracing his fall, but doesn't quite get to throw out the hitbox. Good Nair to catch the air dodge on the second hit. Baits back the uh, auto radical. Runs through the explosive flame with the F tilt. Goes for the fake ledge trump there, but Koda just patient, waiting on the ledge. Doesn't uh, get too hasty. Throws out an up tilt. Unfortunately, going to get punished. Does manage to find his way back on stage with the back air. Throws out a couple explosive flames. Tries to maybe get one of these to clip Vodka and put him in a really bad juggle situation. Maybe clean up the stock with an up air or something. Does eventually hit the jab. Oof, fakes him out with the uh, warp. Threatening that warp cancel drag down. We saw earlier Vodka panicking, running in, and then getting caught by that up smash. A great sequence. Definitely showing the kind of stuff he's going to need if he wants to bring this back. But for now, going to need to get around this edge guard. Down tilt two frame, getting bent on stage. The high recovery will get around the edge guard. But he's going to have to do it all again if he wants to stay on the stage. Warps back to center. Vodka not quite fast enough to punish, but only 100 th or 113 built up on Koda already. He's not going to need that much if he wants to end this stock. You see Koda needing to play very defensively throughout these auto reticles. But Vodka very prepared for them running in this time, though. You get past the explosive flame. Trying to play with the distance, show that even with this lead, he's not afraid to potentially run in back here. Not going to catch the recovery this time, but a good counter will get Koda out of that situation. Tries to get, he's running with the dash attacks. We've seen dash attack be very successful from getting out of these weird situations. That was a weird panic situation, weird, some spaghetti, but you know what? It worked fine for both players, honestly. Uh, Vodka finding the fair off stage. Is this going to be the end? Good recovery back. Another great counter to catch the landing off or to catch the uh, attempted ledge trap. 
We've seen a decent percent build up and another counter explosive flame barely not going to clip vodka is he going to be able to clean up this ledge option no jumps above the down tilt now has him on the platform tries to bring him up with the nair this time the f tilt is going to catch out the jump and that's going to be the game I believe that was a 2-0 for Vodka, if my information is correct. Uh, I apologize if the update overlay wasn't updated. 